Don't even think about it. Just let your body do it. Yeah. Yo! Oh, so oh, he did it! The unfinished business from last time. Oh my god. Hey everybody, we're back out here at the garage and it's kind of a weird start to things. Rather than taking it easier, warming up like you usually would, like we usually would, with the down boxes or the quarter pipe or more traditional style tricks, we actually started with some really strange setups. In fact, had a piece of angle iron just laying around, it was only six feet long, and I decided, well, I should show you instead of tell you. Check this out. We set up the angle iron so that it was on the edge of this box jump it's not actually attached in any meaningful way, though we did put a couple screws to kind of anchor it down. But uh, then the idea was to grind this and transfer to that. So I don't know, we've got some mad scientist stuff happening out here. Maybe it's a good idea, maybe it's a terrible idea. Probably a combination of both. That is madness after all, there's a little bit of brilliance to it. But uh, anyway, we'll see what we can get going with this. We've got Dave out here, we've got Jake out here, and uh, you know, between the three of us, I think we can make some things happen. Magic is cooking. What do you think of our new setup out here? It's terrible. Do you want to uh, give us the rundown of I, this I obstacle? I hate PVC. I hate cool stuff. No, no, no. I mean the, the neon the, sign is awful. The obstacle that we're skating right now. Could you give us the rundown of this one? Oh, the angle iron of yeah, death? Yeah, yeah. yeah, no, that's terrifying. Why would you do that? What are you thinking, Dave? I don't know. Something up it. Is it something across? Is that what I do? OK. Something to something to something. I like it. Something to something. That's just vague enough to be awesome. Now I know that you're going to watch that and you're going to think, man, Dave can't skate. And that's partially true, but really, how packed in everything in here makes everything that much harder. Like, if you don't get the perfect drop in, it's just not going to happen. So we'll, we'll try that again, Dave. Take two. Dave, that before. was real nice. We'll give you one of those. We'll give you one of those. We'll give you one of these. Woogity 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 yeah. Rocket, Rocket power. power. Yeah. Rocket power. <laughs> Too fast. Yeah. <laughs> Try the uh, kick turn instead. Would you care for a spot of tea? A spot of tea? A spot of tea. That's the spot. You bring the tea. The tea kettle. No juice for you. No Ooh, juice for you. Though. You get tea. Ooh. You get tea. Thank you. It's like a tea packet. There you go. Tea packet. Nice. Sweet. Mizus. 
So Dave's working some like quad switch ups up on the box, the sub box, and that's a lot of footwork to happen in just 16 feet of space, especially since you're losing the first couple of feet from the launch. And then you might lose a little bit on the back end because you don't necessarily want to grind right off the edge, but he's putting it to work. He's using it all, using every piece of the PVC. Get it, Dave. That one was much better, and the <laughs> fall at the end is what really makes the flip. I'm so good. <sighs> My contract is complete. He cleared it. Mission complete. Yes, sir. That was good. You got approval here. Approval here. Three out of three judges agree. That Dave is sick. I didn't grab it. <laughs> that was great. I actually got my heel up too. That's one that like the extra friction actually helps. So like doing it on square, doing it on something that's rough is actually easier. One of those rare, one of those rare moments when the PVC is actually more difficult. That was really good. Well done, sir. <sighs> it's just how I pictured it in my head. That's 50 the best. Points. That's the best. No, that's 50 points to Gryffindor. Those boots are rocking. Don't come a knocking. Knocking boots. That's the rule, everybody. You always have to have fun when you're out skating, even when it's frustrating, even when you're mired with inaccuracy and inconsistency, as I often am. You just gotta push through it and enjoy the moments because how often are you going to have that opportunity to be out skating with your buddies? And that's why Dave is gonna land this trick and it is gonna be one of the sickest things you have ever seen. That was yeah. a good All switch right. trick. Uh, Ladies and gentlemen, uh, that, that is how you switch. <laughs> Such a Dave moment. Such a Dave trick.
this from last time. Oh my God. Ladies and gentlemen, for those of you that weren't tracking, that was a 360 sole to alley-oop topsail on a 12-foot box. That's a lot of footwork in a short period of time. Woo! How are you feeling? I'm so relieved. He's tired, he's relieved. I've been thinking a, about that one, man. Took a bit of a hipper earlier, too. Yeah, I know. I was thinking I was gonna fall into the same routine as last time, where I was just missing it, falling underneath the supports, so. That's your passive-aggressive way of me telling me to finish the boxes. No, no, I, I kind of like that they're not finished, oh. honestly. It, it makes you commit. Because when you take a fall like that, you're like, all right, you got to commit, otherwise that's going to happen again. Dude, that was so Do good. Do it right. <laughs> Hell yeah. That was so good. Like, we got a couple different angles to comb through. Uh, I was kind of far away from that on the fisheye one, but I think between the two of them, you guys are going to see some fireworks. Fireworks.